Are you planning a trip to Germany or simply want to impress your German speaking friends? One of the most important phrases you should know is how to wish someone a good day. So welcome to another quick and easy lesson for beginners. In this video, I'll be teaching you the proper way to say have a good day in German. So if you are ready to impress and spread some positivity, keep watching. I'm Salome and I'm a native German teacher from Frankfurt. Every week I bring you new German lessons on my YouTube channel. So if you don't want to miss out, then make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified every time I upload a new lesson. All right, let's get started. Los geht's. The most common phrase you can use in order to wish someone a good day is einen schönen Tag noch. Repeat after me. Einen schönen Tag noch. Einen schönen Tag noch. The phrase consists of three words. Einen, schönen and Tag. Einen means a or one in English and it's used to refer to day in this case. Schönen means nice or beautiful, while Tag is the day. Now let's take a look at the pronunciation. The first word, einen, is pronounced as einen. The SEH in schönen is pronounced like the English SH sound, so it's pronounced schönen. If you're struggling with the Ö or so-called o umlaut sound, then definitely check out this video right here for a full breakdown on how to pronounce it properly. Lastly, the word Tag is pronounced with a K sound at the end. Tag. Tag. So when you're in Germany and you're leaving a shop or the supermarket, for example, you can use this phrase. Oftentimes, however, the cashier will say it to the customer. And in that case, you can respond with Gleichfalls, which means to you too. Gleichfalls. Gleichfalls. Einen schönen Tag noch. Danke, gleichfalls. With friends, you can also use the phrase Lass es dir gut gehen, which means like enjoy yourself, treat yourself. It's a way of wishing someone well and reminding them to prioritize their own well-being. Repeat after me. Lass es dir gut gehen. Lass es dir gut gehen. In the phrase Lass es dir gut gehen, lassen is a verb that means let. The pronoun es refers to an unspecified subject and the reflexive pronoun dir indicates that the action is being done to oneself. So the phrase can be literally translated to let it go well for yourself or take care of yourself. It's a very common way of saying goodbye or wishing someone well. I use this phrase personally all the time. In order to respond to that phrase, you can say danke. Du dir auch. Thank you, you as well. Danke, du dir auch. Zum Beispiel, lass es dir gut gehen. Danke, du dir auch. Another way of wishing someone a good day is to say, genieß deinen Tag, which means enjoy your day. Repeat after me. Genieß deinen Tag. Genieß is the imperative form of the verb genießen, which means to enjoy, and is pronounced with a hard G sound and a long E sound. The sharp S at the end of the word is pronounced like the S in the word snow. Genieß. Genieß. Genieß deinen Tag. In order to respond to this phrase, you can simply say, Danke, du auch. Thanks, you too. Genieß deinen Tag. Danke, du auch. If you have enjoyed this quick and easy lesson, then don't forget to like this video. And if you want to learn more from me, then definitely make sure to check out the free training for beginners, which is a taster lesson of my German online course for beginners. The link to register is in the description box below. I appreciate you guys. Thank you again for watching. Das ist alles für heute. Vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen und bis zum nächsten Mal. Tschüss.